You told me Chief Okundu remitted four million into your account. So that's all that matters to you as a woman? Do you know I have completely lost the peace that comes with serving the Lord? I don't know what you're talking about, but I have told you not to concern with things like that. Do not bother yourself. Your husband is out there living the La Vida local ah, lifestyle. Ah, ah, please don't tell me that because you know it's not true. You have made me commit sin and in covering up that sin, you're making me commit more sin. And what is your definition of sin? Doing something you're enjoying? Something that puts money into your account? Coming in contact with the high and mighty in the land? Is that your definition of sin? Now I want to know. My husband. Welcome. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. What is this woman doing here? Is she not the same woman that I warned you to stop mingling with? What is she doing in our living room? Excuse me, Pastor Daskanga. You asked your wife to stop seeing me. I don't get it. You think you're better than me? I'm not going to dwell on that. But I'm going to tell you right here and now that you are a bad influence on my wife. And as long as you have refused to bend to the leadership spirit of the resurrected Christ, I want you to stop coming here. And by that, you think you're under the leadership of that spirit? Oh, please, 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 Tina. Don't speak to my husband that way. Please leave. Go now, Tina. Leave. That's your thing. But she wouldn't listen, and I don't know what I must do. You know exactly what to do. But you have clearly refused to do it for reasons best known to you. I need you to guard your faith jealously. For your faith is the most important thing in life. This is Nollywood Pictures, Steve. <laughs>